Today, a judge denied the request to have Marilyn Mosby's federal trial moved to a different court outside of Baltimore City. The judge also had some choice words for Mosby's attorney before implementing a gag order. WMAR 2 News' Brittany Verner brings us up to date with the surrounding of today's hearing. The defense counsel argued that if the trial be moved to a different court in Greenbelt, it may be more convenient when it comes to selecting an unbiased jury and completing the trial. But prosecutors and the judge say it's no data to support this claim, which is why the judge denied that request for now. She's being charged with allegedly stealing her own money. 120,000 federal employees took money out of, under the CARES Act out of their 457Bs. Not one, not one of them is being prosecuted by the U.S. government. Oh, I'm sorry, there is one, Marilyn Mosby. If I could curse, I'd tell you it was all bullshit. These comments are why the judge implemented a gag order against Marilyn Mosby's defense team. These statements were made last September following a pretrial hearing on Tuesday. In addition to the gag order, the defense asked if the trial could be moved to Greenbelt. They argued it could be more convenient when it comes to selecting an unbiased jury. They believe if they select jurors in or around Baltimore, they could already have an opinion of Mosby or her former position as state's attorney. The motion to move the trial was denied by the judge. The defense provided no data to support their claim of a jury selection from Greenbelt, having less knowledge of Mosby or her work. A court questionnaire will go out soon, and that's supposed to help select a jury for trial to prevent prejudice. The judge says once they get that data back from the questionnaire, they will revisit that request if the numbers show it could cause issues when selecting a jury. A questionnaire will go out to begin with the jury selection process, and the next hearing is set to be sometime between the end of February and the beginning of March. Mosby is facing multiple federal charges involving perjury and making false statements on a mortgage application.